Wai Guruji Ka Khalsa, Wai Guruji Ki Fateh. I'm Jate Kaur Khalsa, South African by birth, but Punjabi by heart. And today we're visiting Gudwara Sahib Bibi Mumtaj, which is in the Pukali area near Roper. People ask me, what do I love about India and why am I here? Well, firstly, I love Punjab. I love the wide, I love buffaloes, water buffaloes. I scooty ride. Absolutely. The freedom of being on the back of a scooty going through India. Open fields, harvest in time. And I love auto rickshaws. Here's one coming from the front. And more scooties and people are walking. It's total freedom. It's absolutely amazing. People see the big cities on TV and never actually come to experience the real life. What do I love about India? The people, the lifestyle, the freedom, the peace, and Punjab specifically, the open spaces, the forest, the water. There's so much water in India. It's absolutely amazing. Param and I'm driving through farmlands and definitely not the beaten track, which most people will follow. Far in the distance, Param actually points out to me the Gurdwara that stands out in the middle of a forest. Okay, great. In the time of war, Nihang Khan's daughter was named Bibi Mumtaz Sahib. During the time of Guru Gobind Singh Ji and when the Mughals were attacking the Sikhs, many farmers at that time hid away, protected and lied about warriors that was in their care. But before I continue, let's stop for some longer. And I was going to tell Param to stop that we can drink something. We find a cold drink stand next to the road. You will never go thirsty or hungry in Punjab. It's absolutely unbelievable. And it's for free. Why Guru? Why Guru? Why Guru? How blessed we are. How blessed we are. After quite a drive, the Gudwara Sahib appears in front of us. How prestigious, how beautiful. This tiny little Gudwara built up quite high onto a platform, it seems. Let's go and look what's inside. This Gudwara Sahib is today still managed by Nihang Singhs or the Sikh Saint Warriors. Quite a steep entrance, going high up onto the hill, as it's real right on the top of the hill. The Gurdwara Sahib, in the memory of Bibi Mumtaj. The walk up the steep side entrance takes quite a while. There is the Gurdwara Sahib. Wow, isn't it amazing? And a blue Nishan Sahib which is a sign that it is run by Nihan Singhs. It's time to continue the story. Well, during that time, a Nihang Singh Khan's daughter was named Bibi Mumtaz Sahib, looked after a gentleman called Bai Bachitar Sahib, who lay in a small room due to wounds. Bibi Mumtaj overheard her father saying to the Mughals that her do his daughter is nursing her very, very ill husband. So Bibi Mumtaj decided to accept Bai Bhattichar Singh as her husband from that moment onwards. After Bai Bhattichar Singh rejoined with God, Bibi Mumtaj chose to remain unmarried and lived like a widow of Bai Bhattichar Singh. This tiny Gurdwara Sahib is located on top of a hill and it was actually a fort in the olden days. On the left hand side you see a beautifully crocheted circle. That beautiful cloth is covering the Nagara drum. What a beautiful, colourful, tiny and extremely powerful little Gurdwara Sahib. We sit for a while, pay our respects and meditate, thinking back to this beautiful gesture of this lady. At the back there is a small room which is Bibi Mumtaz's meditation room and all the Babaji's that came after her that also meditated in this specific exact spot. On the bottom right 
or the cushions and areas she used to sit meditate on. I thank Param from APS Param channel for this lovely outing today. Please like, share and subscribe to my channel and please follow me for the next adventure. Why Guruji Ka Khalsa, Why Guruji Ki Fateh.